In the last episode, we have created our haunted cemetery. Now let's make the scene interactive with Koblox. How about the vampire sleeping in his coffin? And the coffin opens when clicked. Adjust the vampire first. Make sure both the vampire and coffin are enabled for Koblox use. Use the When Clicked co-block. Then, use the Set Animation co-block to make the vampire move and the coffin open. We can even play a spooky sound when it opens. Upload your sound in the Upload tab and use the Play Sound co-block to add it in. Let's make a bat fly over your head. Create a path in the air, add a bat, and enable it for Koblox. Use the Move on Path Koblox to make it fly along the path. You can hit play any time to test the speed. And to keep it flying forever, Use the Forever Co-Block. What's a haunted cemetery without a ghost night? Lower his opacity to 50% to make him look see-through. Set his animation to walk. Give him a path. and use a Run Parallel block so he can move while other actions happen too. Make sure it's placed at the end of your script when using the Forever Co-block. Otherwise, you might use the Run Separately Co-block. Finally, if you don't already have one, add a camera from the library. Now, it's time to test your haunted cemetery. Explore your spooky creation. And don't forget to let your friends play it too. Happy Halloween.